Welcome back to the channel and I'm doing Nova Play with the Ridgeline Baja Trophy Truck. I wanted to pick the Rally Fighter as so it's the vehicle I normally go with if I do ultimate off-road vehicles. In the beginning of this race, the guy standing still and zooming past us made me think like some sustenance was going on, maybe they were lagging out because someone else was zooming there again that particular driver will have issues and also the other driver will have issues but I decided to start using um, the Ridgeline trophy truck Baja trophy truck over the um, rally fighter because I noticed Letty in Fast and Furious um, one of the, I think it's one of the later Fast and Furious is when she starts driving with a rally fighter and I was, when I saw that because my first kind of um, when I started noticing that car was in um, uh, Forza Horizon uh, 4 and to see it actually appear in a movie I was like hmm, that's kind of cool because it just goes to show um, how games like this and I mean even the Gran Turismo series like they introduce you to to like cause that is like well known but because they aren't well known like in your territory like from my side that's always like something nice because the roof cars from from Gran Turismo I mean like if Gran Turismo 1 <laughs> if Gran Turismo 1 came out in like say like 10 years ago or something and they decided to use Nakai-san the guy who does the uh, body kits I can't remember what this company is called and they just like use these designs and body kits is like a company in the game similar to Ralph I honestly think that would have been like super funny and then it's like to replace either Porsche or Ferrari like when um, Gran Turismo didn't have um, Porsches and Ferraris in the game yet I think that would have been like the I think it would have brought that person Nakai-san to um, to my attention because I think on, I only started noticing his company I will I will correct myself later on but I only started noticing this company um, when I started using social media more and I was like because there was a point in life where I was like now nah, fuck social media I'm not going to use it much and then instead of looking at girls to working I was like now nah, fuck it I want to see some cool cars because I started getting more into games like you need for speeds and stuff like that and that's when I started noticing um, like people doing car videos where they were like oh this is like the car culture in Japan whereas we don't have it something similar to it on the side of the world again because car culture wise yeah on my side I don't really know it other than people doing like low level drifting uh, with the goal spinning um, yeah but it is strictly um, me not knowing kind of thing because if someone had to tell me like hey there's a like some super cool underground street racing scene here in South Africa or even because um, I do know people um, I do know people do the uh, uh, um, racing 
street racing stuff. And then there was like a couple of years back, um, some guy who made like an accident with the BMW. And the only thing I was thinking about that at the time is, could it, could it have been because of no rear downforce? Because his back end did slide out from the looks of the video. But funny enough, and lucky enough, the dude still survived. And I think the first scene back is like, nah, I'm back to trying to race, but I don't think how he was gonna do it, but that was just something that I uh, saw. Um, but at the end of the day, games in the racing games or car games, do do try to show you something from a just a different time frame in a different um, perspective because if you if you look at something like um, need for speed uh, need for speed underground one they did the whole tuner car scene is it was mainly about like your exotic cars like in the previous Need for Speed games and I think that's why Need for Speed Underground 1 was such a big change up to the whole like a racing scene and all that stuff or oh, racing games um, because then you get other games like SRS I tried downloading that game I tried downloading Juiced because I keep seeing it pop up everywhere and those games nowadays are extremely I, th I would say unplayable because of like how games have evolved but this with just the quality of life stuff from uh, for the days of you know more current games but yeah like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys with some more videos of content and blabbing about random things that I find interesting about. I would want to say car culture, but I'm very limited in my uh, knowledge on car culture.